Here's a quick color cast removal technique I learned from uh, Photoshop a couple of years ago online and I've seen it uh, repeated in uh, a few variations. Um, I take this image of a zebra at a wildlife preserve through the windshield of my car and uh, it's got an over green or, over, or it's got a, an overcast of green to the image itself. Uh, the way I could quickly uh, correct this is uh, I can duplicate the layer from the layers palette, uh, go up to filter, down to blur, and choose average. What this does is it averages all the colors in the image and gives you a solid color. Next I go to the adjustment layers and I choose levels and the gray point adjustment tool. And I click on the solid color and this turns that solid color into a neutral gray. Next I go back to my layers and I turn off that solid color layer and now we have the adjusted layer and the original layer. Now this still has a bit of blue in it and stuff. The nice thing about the adjustment layer is it's non-destructive. You can edit it. So I'm not going to double click on the actual um, adjustment layer itself and uh, go in here for this one I'll, I'll try auto seems like it might be a little too much uh, there still so I go to blue and just uh, bring that down a bit increases the black go to green bring that down some and now the white is pretty white and the black is pretty black I go back to my layers again and remove the adjustment to show you what it looked like. That's without the adjustment and that's with the adjustment. Quite a difference. It doesn't work with all images but for the ones it does it's it's a nice little thing to have in your back pocket and it's quick to quick and easy to do and with the adjustment layer to undo. Uh, here's another image uh, I took of my daughter. We were out photographing one day and uh, the uh, lighting wasn't all that great <laughs> so anyways for this one here same thing I'm going to duplicate the original layer I'm going to go up to filter blur choose that average average blur go to my adjustment layer up to levels choose the gray point uh, tool click on the solid color go back to the layer turn the solid color off and that's the adjusted image this is the original image and like I say you can click on the, uh, the adjustment layer go into the individual colors and uh, do some uh, tidying up if you want and that's pretty well it. So, just to recap, with the uh, Zebra in the Layers palette, I duplicate the layer, use the uh, filter, blur, and average, got the solid color, went to my adjustment layers, did levels, came up with this, chose a gray point adjuster, clicked on the uh, solid color, then I turned the solid color off and went in and made some uh, fine adjustments with uh, the actual adjustment layer itself. Hope that was useful and uh, not too long-winded. <laughs>